Good day everyone. In this video, I will show you the easiest way to install the NVIDIA graphics driver in Linux. There are three methods of installing the driver. The first one is through the driver file. You can download the NVIDIA graphics driver from the NVIDIA website and then install it. The second method is through the terminal console. You will type few syntaxes and it connects through some repository and then install the driver. The third method is through software updates. On this video, we will be focusing only on installing of the video graphics driver through software updates. Among the three methods, the software updates is the most easiest way and the most painless way to install the NVIDIA driver. It will be just a few clicks and then it will be completed. So let's start. So here on my background is my system. Ubuntu Distro is currently installed and let's open the software updater. So click software updates and the software updater window will be displayed and then from that window click settings. So among the tabs click additional drivers. It will scan for the drivers that will be installed and select NVIDIA driver 470 and then click apply changes and then type your password uh, do it twice and installation will now start. It will take around 2 to 5 minutes uh, depending on your system. So currently right now uh, there's a small bar uh, displaying the status of the installation. So while waiting for that to complete, uh, let's discuss a little bit regarding the drivers. So as you can see in the additional drivers, uh, there are a list of possible drivers that are compatible with the system. So on the bottom part, you will see the NoView driver. The NoView driver is the open source driver for NVIDIA graphics, NVIDIA GPU. And above the NoView are the list of NVIDIA drivers with different versions. So my advice, my suggestion is that you choose the latest version to install. In my case, as of right now, the latest is 470. So that's why uh, I use that version. So in your case, uh, you choose the latest also, latest version. So it depends on what's uh, release will be released after this one. So you just choose the latest one to be safer and to have uh, the more updates and, and bug fixes. So it's still installing right now. Let's wait for a while. By the way, uh, if you don't need advanced uh, graphics features uh, such as uh, gaming, video editing, or any apps that requires intense graphics, then uh, you could use NVIDIA driver. Otherwise, just use uh, NoView driver. So, 
installation now is complete and let's click the close button and then let's close also the software updater and then let's open uh, the terminal console and type reboot to reboot our system so after rebooting uh, we'll open we'll open the we'll open the terminal console to determine if we have successfully installed a driver so let's go to after rebooting okay so after rebooting okay open terminal console and then uh, our objective here uh, i did not show the rebooting because it it is not captured uh, during the screen record uh, it, the screen record stops while rebooting so the next video that I have shown is already this video that has already uh, rebooted and I type lsb release dash a uh, just to know the Ubuntu versions that currently I have but the most important thing is to know if your NVIDIA driver was installed successfully so to do that type nvidia dash smi so if it displays a lot of informations like driver versions and other details okay so this is the right uh, display so for this display uh, it means if it displays many items like this uh, it means that the NVIDIA graphics driver was installed successfully otherwise uh, there might be an, an error display something like that not, not, not the same as this display then if that happens uh, you need to install again go to the process that that we have a while ago using software updater so as of now uh, this this uh, driver 470 was successfully installed. Okay, thank you for watching. And if you like my video, just hit the like button. And then if you have any questions, uh, just write in the comments below. And I will try my best to answer it. So thank you very much for watching and if you're not yet a subscriber, please hit the subscribe button. See you on my next vlog. Thank you very much.